Stay a blue strip, keep the shit on honey. Yeah, cause loyalty don't cost nothing. I'ma hold it down, girl. I hope that's worth something. Um, before this video to tone, I just ended up letting the hair extensions soak in purple shampoo with water. I left them there for like about an hour. That's why they're this color, you guys. All right, you guys, so I have my setup all ready. I'm about to make some color. I'm actually going to use one box and a half. We're going to go back to the technique that I showed you guys in the other video, which I got from another YouTuber. You just cut the top. And then you just, yeah, you just let it come out. Oh my gosh, it looks so red. So first I'm just going to grab an extension. I'm going to brush it through. the extension you guys I'm actually going to start this way I know it's gonna be funny but I'm gonna start this way and color it from the top to the bottom And that's all you're gonna be doing for all of them you just don't want to you know go against the hair because you'll break it um, and they are extensions so they get damaged so much faster by the way you guys these extensions are from Sally's these Sally's ones I felt like were not thick enough so I had to go order some from Amazon but anyways you guys I'll let you guys continue to watch the video I'm just going to be coloring my extensions
right guys so I'm already done straightening my own hair um, as you guys seen my girl Nalisha over here um, decided to step in and help you girl out you know what I'm saying so thank you girl it's time to say goodbye so you guys I ended up using my doll head for this video because as you guys seen my hands got a little tired with the blow dryer so I was like hey why not just use my doll head so if you have a doll head or anything like that that can support like the clip-ins or anything that you can attach it to um, it's just easier to blow dry so. so now I will be installing my extension so I'll show you guys step by step how I do that um, so I'm just gonna unclip these guys from my girl because you know she she got a little excited wearing my extensions but um they're mine so she has to get them back Um, okay you guys so for this part all you need honestly is something to section your hair with I'm using that and just a little clip to like clip away your hair so first I will be sectioning the bottom half and just uh, clipping your extensions as low as you want um, the lower the more natural they look because the less like if you have short hair like me the less they show but if you have long hair um, and you're just wearing extensions for, um, for it to look thicker or fuller, then that's fine. You can honestly apply them anywhere because, like, you don't have short girl problems, but it's okay. You don't have, you know, short hair, but yeah, so there's that. So I'll do that. Make sure you put this away too so you guys can see. Okay, so I'm doing it this low, you guys. And what I like to do with my hair extensions is I like to tease the part that um, I'm going to clip the extension to. I'll just do that. And then I'll grab the clip, the shortest one that I have, which is this one. Um, and then I'll just clip it there. And then I will do the same on the other side. Another technique that you guys can do to make them look more natural is that bottom layer that I teased a little bit. All of that could just be one braid connected and then um, it'll actually end up looking more natural and less like blunt if you know what I mean. Um, if you guys want to see that, let me know so I can do that for you guys on the next video. Alright you guys, and I hope you guys can see. On to the next. And then you honestly just keep repeating the same thing. Um, but actually, I'm going to be straightening at the same time that I'm installing them. That way it's easier and faster and done at the same time. Um, so, let me actually go ahead and just show you guys that. And then again, you want to make sure that you're using a heat protectant on your hair at all times. You guys, um, always protect your hair. I'll just be straightening it and you guys I'm using my Paul Mitchell straightener that I've had ever since that I went to cosmetology school um, yeah it's honestly my favorite it's never gone down and I literally am so obsessed with it I'm like since the day I got it I was it is my go-to it's my I just love it I just love it um, but see how that already blends super beautifully you guys like you can't even see my short hair um, because I did put it really low and I teased a bit so um, that makes it like less blunt um, so now I'll be going in with the second layer I'll do the same thing I will tease where I want to start so I hope you guys can see it I'll be teasing right here Okay, so there's that piece right there. Um, so now we'll clip the first clip. Here we go, that's nice and secure. And 
I'm gonna do the same thing because this one has three. So I will tease three parts. And that's basically what you just keep doing. You just keep teasing your um, the section you're about to clip it on. That way um, it secures it. So this is actually a really good technique to use when you want your extension super secure. Like if you're going somewhere where you're going to be dancing or moving around a lot, I would recommend doing that because it'll like grab onto your hair and stay put all day. Um, so yeah. But if you're just doing like a little photo shoot or something, um, then you can honestly just wear them without doing that and just clip them in because obviously you're not going to be moving. I mean, you're going to be moving, but like to photo shoot, you know what I mean? So there's that. And now I will be straightening that part too. See you guys, and literally I'm like pulling and it is secure and it feels so good because it feels so tight and like secure I love that feeling now I'm going to be moving on to the top and doing the same thing and you guys I'm using um, I'm using Sally's Euronex hair extensions in a blonde and I'm also actually using a pack of Amazon hair extensions because the Euronex hair extensions were not thick enough for my hair they're actually really really thin so that's why I went ahead and looked at Amazon I looked on Amazon and um, I was like you know what I'm gonna see what's up you know I'm gonna see if these are good and so I ordered some on Amazon and actually it had a lot of really good reviews so I was like hmm let me try it out <laughs> and I love trying things out so I'm like hmm, I think I'll do that you know and actually now I feel like now that I have these two packs, I feel like it's enough hair. Like, it feels good. I feel safe. I feel like <laughs> I don't have half a head on. Half a head of hair. You see? So right now what I'm doing is just measuring my head and seeing which one is long enough width-wise um, to apply. Let me see. I need a really long one. Where is it? Oh, I think I found the one. Okay. All right, you guys, so I'm just going to go ahead and do that to the rest of my hair. And um, yeah, so I'll let you guys watch. Overall, you guys, I am obsessed with how they turned out. <laughs> They're not like the exact shade of my hair, but it does have a lot of dimension to it. The color that my hair grabbed also has dimension to it, so I feel like it actually blended. Like, it, it looks more natural, if that makes sense, and less like blunt. But anyways, you guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed this, this part too. If you guys have any questions, make sure to put them down below. I am answering every single question that I had and also I had one comment where someone asked me how many washes it took for it to wash out until I had to recolor it again and honestly you guys I was not keeping track I color my hair so much that like I don't even I don't even notice anymore I just like go with the flow and then I just color when I need to but um, this time I will be checking how many washes it takes for it to fade out completely before I have to recolor it and then um, I'll let you guys know on my next video and i hope you guys enjoyed this thank you so much to the ones that subscribed from my other video i really appreciate you guys but yeah if you guys really enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe down below and i will see you guys on my next video bye